I got you. Time to go boom, boys. No, no, no. Spider-Man has got defenses. Good, Pete. I saved the tracker. Let's go, man, before he gets too far. No. He's mine. You sure? He's got big teeth. So do I. Um, he's not normally like that, right? No. He's never like that. Tracker says Connors is in the Upper West Side sewers. Better move. Hey, any luck at Connors' house? No, but tracking him right now. What's wrong? Nothing. Meaning something. Miles was off his game. We almost had Lizard. I'm sure he was just trying to help. Sometimes it's just easier to do things myself. Hey, that's not fair, Pete. We're a team. We just really need Connors right now. For Harry. Okay. Let me know when you find him.
Is it Fashion Week? Spider-Man seems to think so, debuting an all-new black costume. But, dear listener, if this tiger has changed his stripes, he is still very much a menace! In a heated battle with the hunters, Spider-Man left Queens in shambles, destroying private property and making his problem everyone else's. This fight escalated, cascaded, and culminated in a chase on the East River with his partner, Spider-Man Jr., joining the fray to create more chaos. Eyewitnesses are indicating they spotted a giant lizard in the river. Let's hope it's not THE lizard. That would only prove my point. Rehabilitation is a myth, a fantasy, a joke. They go away and come out the revolving door. Nothing's changed, except they know what mistakes not to make next time. Call me cynical, but I'd rather be cynical and safe than naive and deceased. It's okay to admit that some people are just bad.